Domains centrally managed within High Level can be one of the most powerful features that you can use within your business, and here's why. Think about it. High Level's core offer is bring all of the software needs any business owner has to one central platform. And centralized domain management, which High Level has brought to us, is one of the last pieces to that puzzle to keep all of our customers on our platform, giving them a simple and easy to use experience. And now we can do that with domains. Not only can you connect domains to use all the tools within High Level with domains you have through other providers, but you can transfer in domains, purchase domains, and centrally manage everything right within the High Level domain infrastructure. My name is Andrew, and let me walk you through the powerhouse of an infrastructure this is within High Level. Now, when you log into your sub account, go to settings and then go to domains and URL redirects, this might seem like a really simple feature and it might seem like we're overhyping it, but the power that lies in these two buttons of purchasing or transferring domains or connecting domains is incredible and it can make your experience as an agency owner and for your customers infinitely easier. First, of course, you can connect domains. So let's say you've bought a domain from another provider like GoDaddy, Squarespace, Google, Wix, and you can connect this by clicking connect domain and you want to use this domain with the powerful features of high level. You can do this by clicking connect domain. And then of course you can access all of the different tools like funnels, websites, stores, blogs, webinars, email, WordPress, your client portal, and your branded domain. All of these have one thing in common. It involves adding DNS records manually to another platform. Some platforms have automated DNS record adding, but for most platforms, whenever you click connect and you throw in your domain, then you will be prompted with the records that you can see here that you need to add in order to connect this domain to high level. Now this is great and this is how we've managed things for just about forever now because we've been able to buy domains on other platforms and then connect them to high level just like this. But the most powerful part of the domain ecosystem is the ability to purchase and transfer in domains. Let me show you exactly what that looks like. When you go to purchase or transfer a domain, we obviously have two options, purchasing and transferring. So let's talk about purchasing first. Just like any other domain provider that you could go to, you can search up your domain then put in the end like .com, .net, and even now .ai is supported. You can search for the domain, and then if it is available, you can buy the domain from this platform. There's also an entire page here that helps explain to your customers why it's a great idea to buy their domains through you. It shows the pricing, the ability for them to get a free SSL certificate, free DDoS protection, all of your domains under one roof, and easy DNS configuration. There's also frequently asked questions for agency owners specifically, so your customers won't see this. And whenever we search for our domain, we can see a series of different similar domains, just like any other domain provider whenever you're trying to purchase. You can see different endings like .com, .net, .biz, all these different endings. And then of course you can buy your domain right here. So if we wanted to buy this domain, we can click buy, we can see our pricing option and we can go for different yearly plans. And then also automatically upsells you or your customers into buying other protected domains. So like .org, .net, .uk, different domains that are extensions of the actual domain to give you some more protection. And then once your customers agree, they simply pay right there. They don't have to enter their credit card or anything because their credit card's already in their account. And you as an agency owner could get it charged just to your card. Now this is amazing because if you have worked with anyone that is a brand new business owner and they haven't bought their domain yet, convincing them to buy their domain in the one platform that hosts their website just makes sense. It's the same reason that you can buy a domain from Squarespace and then build a site there or buy a domain from GoDaddy and then they offer you the ability to build your site there as well. This is putting high level up there with the top competitors and this allows you to couple your domain purchasing process with all of the other features of high level. Now let me show you a live example and what makes managing your domains in high level even better. So let's check out this domain that we bought in the platform. We bought this through high level, didn't have to transfer it in or anything, but whenever domains are transferred in, they go through the exact same UI and it looks exactly the same. Whenever we go to manage this domain, we get a really simple user interface that allows you to see A, what connected products within high level you have this domain on. So websites, client portal, email services, things like that, you can see your connected products here. And of course you get prompted to connect to your domain if it's not already. And then for our DNS records, we see this really easy screen here. We can see each one of our records, the type, the name, the content, and then the ability to modify this DNS record by either clicking edit or delete on this screen here. One of the best parts about this is its usability. It's so simple for customers to manage their domains through this rather than all the frustrations that so many people have expressed with using other platforms. If you want to find records, you can search here. You can also filter the records by type, A, C name, and et cetera. And if you want to add records, you simply click add record, select the type, put in the name, the target, and then click save. It's that easy. 
I love the accessibility here because it makes it easier for you and your customers to start their business and manage everything under one roof. Lastly, under advanced settings, we have a simple auto renewal offer. We can turn this on or off without having to go through any complex cancellation process or anything. You simply toggle it off and you're good to go. Now, of course, not all of you or your customers are going to need a brand new domain. Lots of them have already purchased domains on other platforms. So how on earth do you get them into high level so they can experience this ease of use using high levels platform instead of having to deal with other platforms? Well, that is the domain transfer in process. So high level has given us the ability to transfer in domains from other platforms. And that means they will completely be managed on high level, not on those other platforms. It's different than connecting products. When you connect products and add DNS records, you're simply making a handshake between high level and between the domain provider in order to let them talk together. But when you're transferring a domain into the platform, you're getting rid of the other provider altogether and allowing your customer to manage their domain right within high level. And of course, if you or a customer decides that you don't want to manage a domain in high level, you can transfer back out to another provider. So there's tons of options to transfer domains in, make life easier. And if it's not going to work for them, they can transfer out. They're not stuck with high level for life. Looking back at this screen, this is probably closer to what you're going to see in your actual agency if you already have domains that are connected. Up here under internal, these are our domains that have either been purchased or transferred in and are now managed within high level. Our external domains are those ones that have, as I said, a sort of handshake with another platform to use the power of high level with a domain managed by someone else. Now you and your customers will be prompted to transfer in your domains through this sort of UI. You can click transfer now or can select a specific domain to click transfer in on. And we're going to go ahead and click this now. And this is going to start the five step process to transfer in a domain into high level. Now, if you or your customers are struggling, feel free to click the need help button. This will go to a gray label lead connector knowledge base to show people what a domain transfer in is and what the process looks like. So this can walk them through all of the different steps. And of course, I would absolutely recommend you doing this alongside your customers to make sure that they feel safe in transferring their domains to you. The process is pretty simple. First, you select your domain. This is just going to say if it is available for transfer. Of course, you do need to make sure that you actually are the one that has access to the specific domain, and then you can click continue. You'll then have two options to either upload a DNS zone file or auto scan your DNS records to make sure that you're importing all of the same DNS records into high level. So you're not losing any data. I've actually found that either of these work perfectly well. So I will often do the scan records option, especially for the more simple domains that don't have more than 10 DNS records. As you can see here, it just brought in all my records for this specific domain and it works totally fine. Just make sure that you are checking your DNS records with the other platform, make sure that all of them are there. And if they're not, then do the zone file option. Then you can click continue and confirm, and then you'll be able to confirm and finalize your transfer. This is the step that typically takes a little bit of time depending on the domain registrar. Some of them have additional security and additional locking mechanisms in order to make sure that someone else isn't stealing your domain, which is great, but it just takes a little bit of time and can be a little bit cumbersome. But this whole process walks you through it. All you have to do is log into your current registrar. So for this one, it is on Squarespace and you can log in right here. Then you have to disable DNS SEC and remove the who is privacy. This is just to make sure that high level can see the domain, access it and unlock it temporarily. Um, and then of course you do have to unlock the domain. Each registrar will have a different place you have to go in order to unlock your domain. You will have to verify that it's you. And then you simply click unlock or open the toggle. And then that will update in real time over here on high level. You can refresh it here once your domain is unlocked. I know this seems like a hectic process, but for each one of these steps, there is a help doc to walk your customers through how to go through each one of these steps and how it works for specific domain providers like GoDaddy, Namecheap, or IONOS. All these help docs go through all of the steps that your customers and you need in order to do this process. And of course, once you get an authorization code, you'll paste it here and then click confirm and finalize transfer. Once your domains are transferred in, you will of course see them show up under your internal section for domains. You can manage all of your domains in one place for you and your customers, which gives you more control as an agency owner to make sure your customers are getting success and not being frustrated with other domain providers. As I said, this can be incredibly powerful for you as a business owner, because A, this makes your customers process even easier because everything is managed in one platform and they don't have to struggle using other domain providers. And B, it makes your customers more sticky. They want to stay with you longer because they trust you and they know that they can manage everything with their business on one platform. That is what high level is all about. So I absolutely love this feature. As always, if you have any questions about this, refer to the help docs, feel free to try it out yourself or leave a question down in the comments. My name is Andrew and thank you very, very much for watching.